Hello everyone, I'm Pacific the Castle Gamer and welcome back to another video and in this video we're going to talk about a noob build for a wood elf. So if you're a noob to this game, you kind of don't know how to make a build to help out the race that you picked, well here it is, the, the noob wood elf build, that's weird to say all at once. So to get started in your custom build, we're going to talk about the stuff you do before skills. So you're basically going to pick the thief sign for this wood elf and you're gonna pick your specialization as stealth okay that's because wood elf is mainly like stealth based character like light armor sneak and archery stuff like that your two attributes are gonna be speed and agility now normally you pick seven skills for this one i'm only gonna give four that you should really pick for your major skills the other three i will leave up to you so for your four skills you need marksman sneak blade and light armor so it's Marksman, Sneak, Blade, and Light Armor. Now, the general thing with the Wood Elf is you're kind of tiny, so you're slightly, albeit it's kind of negligible, but slightly harder to hit. And you're going to be mainly focusing on sneaking around and using a sword and a bow. And you got Light Armor on, so you can't take a lot of hits, so you're probably going to initiate combat with a bow and then go in with the sword. Some skills that you don't really want to pick for this character um, I would say actually destruction you probably don't want to pick for the wood elf because it really doesn't do much that the bow and the sword already do. I mean if you pick like if you really want a magic thing that attacks I guess but you don't have to worry about destruction and like I said for this one all you really got to do is your stealth character which means don't get hit. You can run really fast you can jump probably really high early on in the game especially and if you sit there and grind out acrobatics or train acrobatics for a bit then your character is going to be able to jump to much higher places and probably kill melee enemies with a bow the other day i was playing um as a stealth character i want to say operator because i'm playing so much siege the stealth character and what happened was i was fighting this tanky character it was like umbra right i could not kill her so what I did was I hopped on a column, she couldn't hit me, and I just pelted her with arrows and killed her. That's what you'll be able to do with this character. Now these builds, this pro these are going to be very short because really there's not a lot to do with every character. So again, for this build, you're going to be a stealth character, literally thief, stealth, speed, agility. I mean the only, st this only thing that you have that is not stealth based is the blade skill. All the other things are stealth based. And of course, you know, if you pick maybe like block or armor or something like that, or a magic skill as you, one of your other three skills, then yeah, it's, it's going to be less of a stealth character, but the majority of the wood elf is going to be a stealth character. And guys, that's it for this video on Oblivion. It was pretty short. These build videos, um, this is the first one. I'm going to do it on all 10 races just because I think Oblivion can be kind of intimidating because it doesn't explain everything to you which kind of sucks, but that's it guys. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed, you can tell me in the comments below. Subscribe if you're new. I hope you get into Oblivion with this build. Stealth characters, man, they're sometimes really fun to play. I'll see you guys in the next episode, stream, vlog, or steam it post of whatever I decide to make.